Hey, what's up guys, it's Arya and welcome to another video of the series How to study in Canada as an international student. In this video, we're going to cover the another topic, how to start looking for the accommodation. So it's, I know it's pretty hard for people or students, those who are sitting outside of Canada and looking for accommodation in Canada. I'm going to cover the top like best way, best possible way through which you can find the accommodation while sitting in India or outside Canada. So let's get started. So guys, first of all, I would like to congratulate all those who already got the approval for visa and going to soon move to Canada. So have a safe journey guys and welcome to Canada. And let's get started. So guys, first possible way to look for accommodation is via or through application. So the two famous applications in Canada is KGT and second one is Craigslist. So KGT is very famous and a lot of people are using here to sell their old stuff or for like looking for accommodations, looking for apartments or looking for a room, shared room or something like that. So you, what you have to do is you have to download the application first. You can download the application of KGT and you can in the, in the search area you can search for like if you are in Montreal or if you are looking for Toronto, you can just write the room in Montreal downtown or room in like apartment in downtown Montreal, something like that. And you can search those things. And while searching it, you can find like a lot of options are over there. And you can you can just uh, you can just send a message and you can ask them directly like is it available or not. And you can get in touch with them. But I would, I would uh, suggest you guys don't try to like uh, sign for 12 month contract or something like that with uh, while sitting in India or outside Canada. Don't try to be signed or pay someone the money like before coming to Canada because there are a lot of scams also. You will find a lot of ads and people will commit you something but they will not give you exactly what they have committed you. So it's better once you will come here then try to sign for a one year contract or six months of contract for a apartment or room. So it's always better to be here and then start looking. So try to find something initially like for one month or two months stay. And then once you will be here in Canada, <clears throat> then try to make friends and try to go to the places and see the apartment and then try then sign the lease for one year contract or two years. And uh, the second option is uh, try to add some groups on Facebook because in Facebook there are a lot of groups uh, like Indians in Montreal, Indians in Toronto and like um, some colleges group like 2020 session for McGill, 2020 session for Concordia University or for CDI College or for Humber College. There are a lot of groups like, th like that, that. So what you have to do is you have to join that group and try to message them like you are moving to Canada in this particular month and you're looking for the accommodation from that duration somebody will definitely comment under your uh, post and they will connect with you otherwise you will find a lot of people are posting their ads and they are looking for people so you can message them separately or message them in their post and you can get connected with them so that is also a best way you can also find the people those who are coming in your session for the same particular course so you can make the friends also in that group that's also a best way and another way is airbnb you, what you can do is you can go to the website of airbnb and then you can look for the city or the province like in montreal if you're looking for go and search montreal you will having the map in map itself you can see there are a lot of areas with different different price per night you can choose according to your budget and according to the place where you want to stay for initially you can choose for five days or two days or whatever your requirement is once you will be here after that you have the opportunity to look around and go around and see the rooms and apartments and once you like it you can sign for a one-year contract so that is also a possibility to uh, initially for initial days you can find the uh, like cheaper accommodation and and the another option is like for like for the gurdwaras like suppose near to your home or if you're living in Sikh if you're from Sikh religion it's very easy for you guys you can directly go to your nearby gurdwara and ask someone to help you 
and they will get you in touch with their particular Gurdwara in Montreal or in Toronto and for initial days when you will come here they, they will help you for few days to get stay there and you can find something for you so that's also a possibility you can use it so and plus like through uh, with your friends through your friends uh, um, contacts you can also ask them to find you something initially these are the ways i would suggest you to look for it for for initial days of accommodation don't go for like once you come here and don't try to find for the um, hotel or something the hotels are pretty expensive per night like hundred dollars per day it's it's gonna rip you from your pocket so I, I would not suggest you to come and then look for hotels for per night it's better for Airbnb to go for Airbnb or something like that if you're looking for per night stay otherwise try to find another options which I gave you that is that is that are going to be best for you for initial stays but I would recommend you don't try to sign any kind of contract or legal documentation while sitting outside the Canada because there are a lot of scams are going there and they're gonna rip you out and if once you sign the legal document and you will not get you will not get away from it so suppose if you sign it for 12 months you have to bear it for 12 months for that particular contract so make sure once you come here once you see the apartment once you like it everything then only sign it because in, in if you are outside the Canada they will send you some pictures and you will sign the contract and everything once you come here you will not like the place then it's going to be hard for you guys so make sure don't make like um, these kind of decisions it would really gonna affect you a lot once you move here so if you like my video or if you still have any questions or doubt you can ask me in the comment section and please like my video and share share it among friends and please don't forget to subscribe my channel and press the bell icon for future notification i'll see you in next video see you bye bye take care